What's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are having a great day. If you're not, well, maybe this will help just a little bit. We got some new mods today. We got the D754 Truck Pack. This thing is pretty darn cool. Goes with the Fortress trailers that we've got. Very neat. Very exciting. Also, we got an update to Stroutman trailers. We're going to take a look at those. We're going to take a look at everything separately today. Because I want to split this up and show you exactly what's going on and what to expect with this truck pack. First up, what do we get? Well, we get one truck and we get three different trailer attachment things that go on the back of it. But we really get two trucks and like five or six trailer things. It, nonetheless, let's go take a look at the truck. So the truck's gotta be right over here. Two trucks in, in two days, wow, that's crazy. This is cool because we've got the ability to change any color we want. This is phenomenal. So we get the four trick colors, but we also get every other color. So let's say you love doing a John Deere. Man, you could do a John Deere. There you go. There it is. You don't like the, uh, the way that looks? Bam. Change it up like that. You've got it. You can create anything you want. Design, go standard. One, two, three. Little Germany flag there. Four, five, six. Standard. Though you can't change those colors, but you know, it, it is what it is right there. And of course, attachers, we have standard, which is gonna be what you want if you want those attachment things that go on the back, or trailer hitch. Boom, there you go. You can have either one of those. It's not too pricey either, $60,000, but do keep this in mind, 200 horsepower. Not a lot of power, to be completely honest. I mean, there's a lot of tractors in this game that have more power than this guy does. Not like this, what, the 620 horsepower tractor we got yesterday. So. Here is the semi-truck version. Very cool, very nice. Works just fine. And then here is the version without. Try to keep everything a little separate, all red versus white and red. Well, you may notice that these are a little higher, the slurry tank and the water tank for it, but the tippers are a little low. Well, let's go look at those. First up in trailers, you're gonna jump in here and then you're gonna find this guy, Lizard Brand. Pow, this is not a Fortress brand. This is a Lizard brand, but it works perfectly with the Fortress pack. Main color, like you think, design color. Again, exactly what you would think. Bang, boom. Capacity, 8,000. We can go 15,000, left and right. Or you can go bell loading wagon. Of course, we've gone for the 8,000 configuration here. So there's a multiple different configurations, but they're low. But they, these are up high so irritating this you're gonna find those over here in slurry tanks goodness gracious i know i know main color of course you can change these however color you would like only does the legs and the water trans you're gonna find in animals right here now you can change this up a little bit more there we go so there you go nice very cool and here's the thing too they're not that much more expensive than these guys right here which I absolutely love. Yes. Bam. So let's jump right in here and let's show you why you're going to need this. So treat it like a pallet. So you've got these, uh, these little places right here where you would, well, it appears to be where you would put these in. And so as soon as long as we can get lined up, we're going to do that. And it's not that heavy actually like this manitou does a really good job now why would we have to do this versus not well a little more realism maybe but the fact that the other trailers have this it's just a little irritating now we could take this now if we want him this manitou is going to do a dance yep there you go can't really have that can we so my recommendation is to be good about it sit it down on it just like that and then back away slowly and then attach there you go well what about when you want to take this off what if i want to put the other pieces on there well you can detach it but it's just going to stay on there so you could do the old back up and then slam on the brakes kind of thing but doesn't really work that well as you can see so we're gonna have to take this thing on and off with the manitou which 
Yeah, it stinks. It stinks a whole lot. Oh, man. Let's get this thing back off of here. But, you know, at least it's easy to take on and off. Could be worse. But the good thing is, the slurry tank and the water tank, we don't have to do like that. For whatever reason, just the tipper. Boom, there you go. We take it off, legs extend, the exact same thing with the water. Perfect. I mean, detaching is not allowed in this state. Now, one thing I have not tried yet, and I really want to, is, let's get this out of the way. Oh man, these things sound awesome when they start up. Can you attach these if you have the semi-truck attacher on here? This, I wonder. So, no. If you have the semi-truck attachment, you cannot, I repeat, cannot hook up to the attachments that it gives you. Very interesting. Okay, wonder why. Huh. Cool. Well, moving on. We also have an update to the Stroutman SZK802 pack. We're going to take a look at that in trailers. Most of you guys, this is going to be the farthest right thing that you can find in here. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Capacity 4,000, 8,000, 12,000, bell loading wagon. Change log is improved wheel suspension and added light state for low spec. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> it is what it is. Nonetheless, we've got an update for it. If you guys use this, make sure you get the update. Now, there is one thing that I did fail to mention with the truck is I mentioned that, yes, we've got the Fortrit pack here. Where's this guy at? Yeah, these guys right here, these trailers, I mentioned that it works with these, and it does. It works very well with these. But it's really meant for this guy right here, the Lizard Pack. Now, we don't have all the crazy color changes we could want, but we've got pretty much all the stuff that you would expect us to have in there. So it will work with that as well, and it's supposed to. And here we've got kind of just some, some thrown together configurations, but nonetheless, really cool stuff. It's not gonna be large scale, it's gonna be smaller scale, but it's gonna be enjoyable scale. That's what we're talking about here. So, with that being said, that is going to be it for today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you're not, please subscribe. If you guys are getting stuck, make sure you drop a hashtag GoHamFam down in the chat. Hope you guys have a great day, and we will see you later. Peace.